Well, the pandemic has created another spike in demand and a dent in supplies. This time it's lumber caught between a surge in home renovations, new housing builds and a slowdown in the manufacturing of wood products. It's become tough to track down timber and as CTV's John Vinavalli Rao reports, it's meant hitting the pause button on some summer projects. First, it was a shortage of toilet paper, then Lysol wipes were hard to find. And now the pandemic producing yet another supply problem. The walk-in guy off the street uh, probably will not get product from us. Across Canada and the U.S., lumber yards are being emptied out, following a surge in demand for many building supplies. Typical summer projects like a new deck or fence have suddenly become fraught with frustration. I thought it was going to be, quote, today, install next week. Instead, some have had to wait several weeks or even months to get pressure-treated wood. In Iowa, these volunteers who build ramps for those with disabilities may have to stop. We'll build this week, and after this week, if we don't get lumber, we're on hold. The shortages are in part due to slowdowns in manufacturing. Because of COVID, some sawmills scaled back or temporarily stopped production. And then that created a gap, and that gap is just getting harder to be filled, and the sawmill is behind, the treating company is behind. All this while there's been an explosion of interest in home renovations, with people forced to stay home looking for something to do. People were taking the money they had saved for their vacations and trips and putting it into their backyards. A housing boom is adding to the demand for materials like plywood, two by fours, and pressure treated wood, with prices soaring and a backlog of orders that some think may not get resolved until next year. This contractor says he's got clients wanting to get work done but have to wait. There's no answer to when we're going to get wood. Uh, it's very frustrating because, you know, we have mountains of work out there and we can't do it. So if you've been dreaming about building a new deck, you may have to keep dreaming until next summer. John Penavelli, Rouse, CTV News, Toronto.